noon, Donald Trump is making another presidential pick that has ties right here to South Florida. He's now chosen the owner of the Florida Panthers as Secretary of the Army. Local 10 News reporter Terrell Fournay is live in Sunrise with a look at this person's background. Vincent Viola is his name, right Terrell? And that's his name, Christy. Good afternoon to you. This news was actually made public just this morning ahead of the previously scheduled practice for the Florida Panthers. The organization, though, is reacting this afternoon to the nomination. First, here's what we know about Vincent Viola. The 60-year-old is a graduate of the West Point Military Academy. He's a former U.S. Army infantry officer, even trained as an Airborne Ranger in the 101st Airborne Division. Viola is also considered a national security expert, providing insight and financial support to cybersecurity and counterterrorism efforts for the country. Now, as we go back to this practice video, I can tell you that Vincent Viola is best known as the owner of the Florida Panthers, even though this billionaire businessman owns several companies. Today, the team, though, is on the ice as normal, taking the news in stride about their boss. The Panthers practice at the uh, Ice Den in Coral Springs, and it's where we met up with the team's CEO, who has been in touch with Vincent once this news broke. Uh, we could not be more proud for Vinny and his family. Uh, if you know Vinny, he's so patriotic. He loves the military. He loves this country. He knows what, what West Point and the Army did for him. Um, and, and it was really the foundation of his leadership. And he's gone on to do some great things in the business world. And So certainly a lot of smiles, at least on the faces of management when it comes to this uh, nomination pick. As for the Florida Panthers, we won't see much of a change at all. In fact, the ownership will remain with Vincent Viola's family. There won't be any big management changes uh, if this nomination is confirmed by Congress. More to come. We are live in Coral Springs. I'm Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News.